Hi everybody. So today it's a new video uh, as we uh, schedule every week, uh, we uh, launch a new video. And then the reason we launched the video is just to be able to prepare and announce our podcast uh, uh, session. And the new episode today, I'm gonna talk about the gender uh, pronouncings. So that's really important because as we know, there's some people have that preference, some people don't, some people with, some people against, some people neutral. I respect all, uh, all views and all beliefs. I'm a person, I believe, and I stand for respecting other people's wishes, no matter where they are. And I support them if that's what they want, as long as it doesn't affect me, they don't force it on me or on, uh, whatever people I know. So that is, that's totally up to the uh, individual how to go about the life. I totally respect that. Uh, no judgment, no, uh, no name calling, no uh, uh, pronouncing uh, something they don't desire. So I'm gonna share with you 10 steps, just summary, how you'll be able to deal with these situations, especially how you'll be able to navigate uh, those situations could be at work, could be if you're looking for a place to live or you want to share a place with a roommate. We have to respect each other and we have to honor each other's wishes. So let's start the, with, the, uh, with those steps. So the first one is uh, definitely we have to educate ourselves to be, become more familiar for what other people are desiring and what they, their wishes is and who they are as a person. Uh, number two is when you meet somebody, uh, usually if you get asked for the pronoun, uh, pronounce, it'll be better. So at least you know what they prefer. Uh, name, she, he, they, uh, z, zer, whatever, whatever them, that's whatever they prefer. And, uh, you respect that and call them as what they uh, what they wish is so as well, and make it normal. So it doesn't have to be awkward. Make it normal. Uh, four is use the gender natural language. So it has to become natural, especially when you talk. So it could be a friend, could be a brother, could be a somebody just made a colleague, uh, a business partner, or somebody you're dealing with in business. So we have to respect that. And then number five. We must listen and respect, definitely. I'm going to talk more detail about it in our episode. I'm going to leave, uh, uh, I'm going to leave the, uh, the link below the video, and you could listen to the whole episode. It'll be rich, and you'll be able to navigate with peace into uh, your life moving forward. At least you don't have to think about it uh, heavily. Uh, number six, uh, you got to practice using different uh, pronouns. That's definitely. Sometimes it's challenging, but we got to build that habit. And uh, number seven is be an ally. You don't have to be against them. You could be an ally with them. You could respect their wishes. And makes life easier for yourself and for them as well. And if, if you're on board with that and you're okay with that, so myself, I pronounce myself as he, I'm a male, but uh, when I meet anybody new or somebody, even somebody I used to know or somebody I know, I talk to every day and they have different wishes. I respect their wishes and I honor it. And uh, I make it very, very comfortable for them to be around. Uh, educate others. So this way, uh, let them see the other side of the coin uh, with ease. So uh, makes life more uh, enjoyable and uh, more laughter into life. We need this, especially with the craziness, what's going on in our life. Number nine is stay updated, be informed. Because it looks like it, every day there's something in you. And number 10, the last one is be patient and be, have some empathy. So this way you could enjoy the journey of your life without having complex and challenges you don't need. We have, we have enough challenges and uh, 
and uh, detours we take in life to be able to achieve our purpose and our uh, uh, our objective in life. So be patient, be yourself, and to be able to navigate to this process. Jump on our uh, podcast where I'm going to talk more detail about it in full. So till next week, have yourself a wonderful day and a safe one and a successful one. Take care.